Good morning, my kids. Good morning, families. Good afternoon, families and kids. How are you today? Fine? Okay, today I'm very happy because we have English classes. Let's start with the book. So open your book at page 10. Okay? We are going to read the title, Unit 1. I like basketball. I like basketball. I like basketball. A mí me gusta el basketball. Yes, look and listen. Look at the dialogue. Look at the picture. Listen and read. Yes, Greta, Lucy, Alex, John. Who are there? Ellos están ahí. Where are they? ¿Dónde están? They are in the school. Yes, they are in the break. Ellos están en el recreo. Listen and read the dialogue. And then we are going to do exercise two. Listen and point. Yes. Listen, escucho el audio y señalo. Point. Listen and point. Pay attention to this picture. This butterfly, this butterfly, that butterfly, this butterfly, that butterfly. Cuando la tengo cerca, uso this. This butterfly. La puedo casi tocar. Cuando la tengo más lejos, that butterfly. ¿Ok? This butterfly. That butterfly. ¿Ok? This butterfly. That butterfly. Está lejos. Digo that butterfly. ¿Ok? Cuando la tengo más cerca, this. Look at this bird, yes? This bird, that bird. This bird, that bird. This bird, that bird. The same here, yes? This, that bird, ¿cuál sería? Acá tenemos que unir en el ejercicio. Tenemos listen and tick. Después vamos a hacer este. That bird. ¿Con qué lo voy a unir? That bird. Está lejos. That bird. This is the picture, ¿ok? That bird. Excellent. This butterfly. Está cerquita, casi que la puede tocar. This butterfly. That butterfly. That butterfly. This bird. This bird. Lo tiene cerca, yes? You have to join. Yes, porque hay que unir, then match, dice. Buscamos el color, por ejemplo, buscamos el color yellow y unimos that bird con el que está lejos, el bird que está lejos, that bird. This butterfly, cerquita, de color green. Purple and pink. Purple, that butterfly, está lejos. And this bird, cerquita, this bird, este que está acá. ¿Te recuerdan? Otra vez, vamos. This butterfly, that butterfly. This bird, that bird. ¿Ok? Well, now, when you finish, go to exercise 3. Listen and tick. Listen, vamos a escuchar a Greta hablar de los, sus deportes favoritos y vamos a hacer un tilde en las cosas que le gustan, ¿sí? De, de deportes... Games and toys and animals. Sports, number two. Hockey, hockey and football. Games and toys, computer games and board games and dolls. Computer games son los juegos de computadora. Board games son los juegos de mesa, dolls, las muñecas. Animals, habla de parrots y de jaguars. Yes? Entonces, de acuerdo a lo que nos va diciendo, like or don't like, si le gusta o no le gusta, miren, look at the face. Like, like, y esto significa don't like, no le gusta, ¿ok? Por ejemplo, podemos decir, esta love, que ama, esa, o ese deporte, o ese animal, o ese juego, like, que le gusta, I don't like, no le gusta, ¿ok? Ok, let's listen about Greta. Sports are fantastic. I love hockey. Le encanta el hockey. Entonces, ¿qué voy a poner? Make a tick here. In love, make a tick. Football, no, I don't like it. Football, no, I don't like. La cara de qué? Don't like. 
Computer games, they are great, son fantásticos. Computer games, love, excellent. And I like board games. Dice que también los board games, los juegos de mesa, like, también les gusta. I don't like dolls. No me gustan las muñecas. I don't like dolls. Animals, well, I like parrots. Le gustan los parrots. Jaguars, no, I don't like jaguars. They are scary. They are scary, son. Yes, they are miedo. Sí, asustan. Ok, entonces, don't like jaguars. Well, this is all the English class. So, see you next class. Bye-bye, kids. Bye-bye. Good luck. See you.